just there. A little bit. It's kind of dark right now, right? Well, over there, I mean, this is this is chickens for eggs. So in this industry, all that you know, they're selectively bred to lay an egg every single day. Whereas in nature, they lay about 18 eggs a year. And then after a few years of being used for their eggs, then they're sent to a slaughterhouse. And the baby boys, those little yellow chicks, because they'll never produce eggs, they're waste products. They're sent into a machine called a macerator, which blends them up, shreds them alive. This little yellow, it's crazy. Actually, I think it's coming up now. Let's see. It's crazy, like because they're like children, like they're like innocent beings, little babies, right? Never done anything wrong. And we treat them worse than we treat the worst child molester, the worst serial killer. They've done nothing. We we literally slit their throats constantly. Slit, 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 slit. Murder, 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 murder. Constantly. A billion a year. A billion animals. Oh, sorry, a billion a, a week. Over a billion animals every week. And these animals, look, like, so this is the crazy bit. So they drop off the conveyor belt into a macerator. Shreds them up, man. They're the most delicate and gentle, and they never hurt anybody. You know, murder, if you murder a human, it's the worst thing you can do. The worst thing you can do. We do it for an egg to these innocent things. For an egg. An egg, we could just have avocado in our toast or peanut butter. No, 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 just who cares? Just slit all the babies, throw to kill them all. Because we want an egg. What? Oh, that's mad. Oh, well, wait. It looks like you're doing a good job, right? She looks like she's pretty shook. Yeah, it's great. Well, well, how do you feel seeing this? Like, what are your thoughts about it? Um, when you just, like, see children, like humans. Yeah. I just think of my, like, nieces and nephews being, like, in a situation, like, in a horrible situation. Like, they'd be like, they this. What about, do you have a dog? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah cool, cool. I, I guess because like, you don't really think about it. Like, no, it's just not. like, it's just like, you see it, it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, so I, like, I know. I don't have to see the process of like, what, looking at it. I was the exact same for 26 years and I was a little further gone because I thought we needed to eat animals to be healthy. So I was like, I'm not, I don't care about it even if I do see it because it has to happen. But when I learned we can be healthier without eating animals, I was like, well, what do we do this for? For a taste? For a specific taste? When there's literally tens of thousands of foods we can eat that don't involve killing little babies or their mums? You know, what are we doing? That's for eggs, that. Like, that's so sick. It's like, it's like, this is what I think, I'm like, every time I think about eating an egg, I go, okay, so I have to take an egg, that means I have to throw one of those little chicks into a blender. Like, I could never do that, because I'm not a murderer. I'm not a murderer. But when you pay for an egg, you're paying someone else to murder for you. You're, pa you're yeah. <laughs> and it's not just eggs, it's dairy. And, and look, it's going to sound hard if I name all these things, but I'm going to tell you things and tell you how easy it is. Dairy, meat, eggs, leather. Wool and, and pro you can get the vegan leather. Get the vegan leather. You won't even know the difference. They make leather now out of mushrooms, out of pineapple, way more sustainable. But also, you don't have to rip skin off innocent animals and use their body to dress yourself. Like, what are we doing? It's not. It's 2017, man. It's not like 20,000 BC. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy that we do this. So it's so far back. It's so in the past. This is so so far in the past that's where it should be but, but it's on the reality is that it's on most people's dinner table and it was on my dinner table for 26 years so I get it I get it completely but now I'm like okay I don't hate animals I don't despise them I'm not a sick murderer that, that just is happy to murder 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 just because I like how something tastes what not at all man so to go vegan's easy, you go to challenge22.com, it's a free 22 day vegan challenge. They give you everything, you see how easy it is, how healthy it is, how delicious the food is. You just try it, like okay, and then you like you message him, you get a free mentor if you want. What do I do if I'm eating in a Mexican restaurant? And then I'll just tell you, get the black beans instead of the meat, put on guacamole instead of sour cream, boom! Like oh my god, I'm freaking out, I'm so Right, exactly! How was it? Was it delicious? Of course it was awesome. That's what we're supposed to eat.
That's what we're supposed to eat. Yeah, that's what you do. It's totally free. Just try it out for 22 days and you'll see. You'll see how why you'll see why you'll see why we're here. Because we're like, join us. It's amazing. We want to share the gift. Because it's so good. Hey, right, let me ask you a question. Is going vegan one of the best things you ever did in your life? Yeah. Easy. Why do you think that is? There's countless reasons. We're not here just like, just do it. It's really shit, but don't, don't tell anybody. We're like, no, it's amazing. It's so good. We want everyone to do it because it's so good. And, yeah. Oh, that's a good deal. She's getting married next week, and then they did a hike. They did like a test on it. Oh, that's good. Like, like, put the cream and stuff all over it. Wow, that's cool. That's cool. Good luck. Congratulations. That's mad. Yeah, so. Like, there's no point in feeling bad or feeling guilty when you, you, when you know better, yeah. you can do better. I mean, it's good that you feel I love bad. Bacon, yeah, I love the taste of bacon too. I do. <laughs> I love bacon, but you know what? There's so many other delicious foods that are just like bacon so that you won't miss bacon. You can make bacon out of rice paper with this. Yeah, like there's rice paper bacon recipes, there's mushroom bacon, there's all different kinds of bacon you can make. It's delicious and chewy and tastes just like bacon. Yeah, yeah, you made it still. Yeah. And it's not the flesh of a little pig that got their throat slit. And it's going to make you so, like, it's just filling your arteries with cholesterol. Yeah. You can just have the rice paper version. It's yeah. even rice paper. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, everything, every every food you've got that you love, there's a vegan version. We've hooked you up. We've big cake for the wedding. We've got, we got bacon for you. We've got burritos and Mexican. Don't worry about it. Everything you need. Okay, if there can be a bacon alternative. Yeah, yeah, sweet. Yeah, I'll hook it up. They'll send you a recipe. These are like vegan bacon recipes and they're like so easy to make. I mean, yeah, and especially compared to what they go through, like, it's a no-brainer, man. But anyway, you just start, what's, do you remember what the website's called? Challenge22.com. Put in your phone. Yeah, so you obviously can Just try it. Yeah, what the hell happened? I don't know why he's been working on it. But we're like, been working on it. If you go back and you say, well, it's a time to work. Like, I was on the verge because I came back from home. Yeah, I said that the day was no, she was Oh, yeah. yeah. She made me watch the cat Oh, thank you. And how they, they just go boom like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's crazy, man. Like, they just baby. No way. Like, not just imagine it happening to them, but imagine you doing it to them, because that's what happens when you... Do you know what I mean? Like, not just imagine that, oh my god, they're getting hurt, you got to imagine that you're the one going and stabbing them, because that's basically what's happening. Of course not. No way. If you see an animal hurt, you go and help the animal. Right? If you see someone hurting them, we go, hey, what are you doing? You know? But then later we're like, go stab an animal in the throat for me, please. I feel like a bacon sandwich. Yeah.